one. That's the other one, Two. Three. <clears throat> so you put the filter in. Put the filter in. You know, do all that. Two scoops. Two scoops of your abumate. Let me say that. Two scoops of mate. I'm saying two scoops. Basically, four cups of water because this is the bigger one. So as you can see, they don't have a two. But usually I would do two. But um, I'm going to do four and I'll let you know what happens. So, you know, obviously you pour the water in there. And now... Close it, start it, and it's starting. This is the older one, a lot more empty, but we got a new one going on. It's about $10 even, you know what I mean? Um, you saw how big it was in the picture, so uh, pretty much. And now it's making, but um, that looks weird, but <laughs> yeah, but um, you saw how big it was in the picture, so it's that for $10, and pretty much what I'm gonna do, you'll see what I do, so you'll see, I mean, so hold on. But you make pretty much, this this holds 12 cups, so you can make all that plus more, but I'm gonna make about 12 cups with two scoops of mate, and 12 cups of liquid. You know what I mean? And over here we got, you probably hear the mate in the background making, but over here we got the ingredients. And I remember I heard carrots are bad for you now. <laughs> All of a sudden, let me but um, in that interview, the professor interview with um, the doctors and the coach and everything. But um, here goes the ingredients for the pig leaves. I'm about to make that, and there goes our wine. I mean, the white wine with some water in it. Um, you know, but anyway, there goes um, seasoned salt, peas. I'm just doing this, you know, I'm eyeballing it now. This is the first time I did it without like looking at the directions I'm you know, I'm making um, enough for two. I'll put the link to the video that how she makes it too, but how I learned how to make it, but um, I'm making two batches. So this is kind of big, but I'm making two batches. So enough for two and maybe more, but so I'm, I got eight scotch, well not scotch, these aren't scotch mine, these are actually habaneros, but um, I'm gonna get two more, but I'm gonna have to get those later. Cause those are kind of small. I mean, yeah, pretty. But it's supposed to get various colors. But those are habanero. So you know, I don't know where to get scotch products, but I'm working on getting scotch ones sometime. I learned where to get them from. But uh, this one chick she lives in South Florida, so it's like right at the um, what you call it, the um, local market. I mean, but this is a, oh yeah, this is the top for that. I had, it, had it looking cool for a second. You know what I mean, like that. And I should have seen, but yeah, you got that. <clears throat> you gotta put it in there, and I'm I'm sure you gotta do it later. But you got coleslaw. Carrots, vinegar, the bowl to mix it in, scissors to cut the peas and all that, cut the stuff and um, knife, knife right there to cut the um, cut the vegetables. Um, I might use a different one to cut this, like a duller one, pretty much. But you know to cut that. The onion I already kind of peeled it. This is the first time I ever took this much time to do it, you know. But I'm actually you know, working on um, making it kind of like you know I was <laughs> anyway um, artistic as well, so. Cause I never really like you know um, recorded the whole process that much either. I'm not gonna record the whole process, but kind of I'll give you a glimpse of it. So all right, I'll be back. And people have been making it super different, but um, I like this way. And this is optional. The bell pepper is optional. You can even get a different color if you want. But um, I forgot about this. So I just looked at the ingredients again. You know, and double checked. And it's a cool picture on it too. So I'm actually show you that. But on the um, computer, I'm gonna show you the phone on the computer. But yeah, peppercorn. This is optional, but I like these in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that too. And that's some, that's that's some ingredients too. And I'm gonna go back to this mate real quick and show you what the deal with that is. You know what I mean? So as you can see, the four cups are just finishing up. So what I'm gonna do is now. I'm gonna fill it up to four again because if I had, if, if it was like two cups, I would fill it up to two. I mean, I'll fill it up to two, then four. What I'm doing though is filling it up to two, go well, four, then four again. Then I'm gonna go to six, then I'm gonna go to eight, then I'm gonna go to 10, then I'm gonna go to 12. Do two at a time. And you'll see, I'm gonna show you the whole process. So um, I think you'll really enjoy this, you know what I mean? So, yeah. And 
so the mod say, you know, the, t the upper line to the right is the line where you fill the water up to. And the other one, see, as it gets taller, it's like coffee, water, as you see different lines, you know. So that the right side on um, both all of them are the, um, is the water. The left side is the coffee. So right now what I'm going to do is fill it up. I'm just going to put enough water in to get to the water side of four. And then I'm just going to pour it back in, you know, act, the actual mate made and everything. And um, pretty awesome. much I turned it off. As you see, power, not the green light. Took the pot off, you know, filled it up to, like I told you, you know. So fill it up just a little bit. Next time I'm gonna fill it up to six. Um, somewhere in, in between there. I mean, but then, um, so you pour it. Like I see, you see? It's the actual mate with the actual water. Pour it in here. I, I can't really record it because I don't wanna, I don't wanna mess up here. Yeah. So pour the actual mate with the water in there. And you'll see what happens. Put it back under. Close it. You see how it's different now. Close it. Start again. Turn it on. You see the green light. And see it's empty. And as you can see, I'll be right back because it's going to be making again. And the measurements are going to be super off because I'm just, you know, just doing it how I feel like doing it. I just wanted the ingredients. So now I'm just going to, you know, really make it my own. But um, pretty much what you do is put all this. So I got to wash this, cut it, wash this, cut it, wash those, cut it. Mm. But pretty much add everything except for the seasoned salt in this bowl. Mix it up. I mix it with my hands. You know, I don't put gloves on. Some people say put gloves on. But mix it up. And then put it in here. Put the vinegar in there, and I'll, I'll walk you through it all, but put the vinegar in there um, on top of all this, everything I'm mixing there. So you put this in here with the vinegar, and you just put it up, I'll show you how to do that too, but just put it in there, um, then put the, the seasoned salt. Then you shake it up, and then 